Hey guys, it's CSO here. Welcome back to Skyrim. Yes, that's right, I still make Skyrim videos. So in this video, we're going to be finding a unique weapon that might not be that great, but has a very good enchantment. A unique enchantment, in fact. We're also going to be finding a unique shout as well. Obviously, all shouts are unique, so I don't even know why I said that. So let's go inside and see what we find. We must gather our strength. Who knows what's inside? Treasure, that's what. Get off your scaly rump and let's it's go. A little bit racist. Hush, Salma. We aren't alone. Hi there. Ugh, we should be inside loading up on treasure. Worry scales here thinks we should wait. Let's talk to worry scales. Get any ideas I admit, we were here first. In numbers. Perhaps I don't care us. what Beam says. It's high time we get in there and find our fortune. Yeah, let's get in there and find our fortune. What do you expect to find? Gold, silver, gems, maybe? Only one way to find out. You're definitely gonna die in there. I don't care what Beam says. It's high time we get in there and find our fortune. Not without us, you aren't. I'm sure there's enough for everyone after all. Come on, Beam Jaff. We're going. You can't You're gonna fight with your fists, are you? Man, we are definitely fucked. Now, I was hoping on this Let's Play being. Oh my god, Spider. I. One sec, I. Bloody hell, we're okay. We're already getting attacked. There's lots of stuff in here. I should have brought my own follower, then I, then I would have had like an army with me. Come on, guys, let's go. I was hoping of doing this quite stealthily, but it looks like they don't really care about stealth, so. They are destroying everything. I'm gonna try and keep up. They're literally just gonna clear this dungeon for me or what? I'm gonna try and get a sneak attack on the next one. Oh my god, that's a short spider! Get out of my way! Yes! Wasn't a very good kill count, I think it hit in the leg. It's like a spider cave, there are lots of dead bodies and stuff in here. Man, these guys really want that treasure. They're like running through this dungeon like there's no tomorrow. This is it. We found Gathric's tomb. Gathric's tomb. Wow, it's pretty cool. It's like a um, Nordic barrow inside a cave. Well, there must be a way through. Look around. Look around. Oh, there's a chest here. I will take your weakness to shock and your soul gems. I'm going to make a few videos on um, some enchanting things you guys can do later on. Danger could be anywhere. Which would be useful for you guys to watch. Um, am I looking for something here or what? I don't know. Where have they gone? Well, it's not there, is it? You are useless. What are you even doing? What am I doing? It's going to be by the door, isn't it? I've been playing Elder Scrolls too much. I mean, Elder Scrolls Online too much. Through here. Activate handle. That was right in my face and I didn't see it. Wow. Are you ready to run off again? I'm going to go first this time. Wooden door. Let's see. I might just kill them, do the dungeon on my own. Oh, yes, pal. No, save the mage. Look at him, he's going crazy. He is nuts. 
This raw demigod this week got so much health. How much damage can you take? Oh, he got penetrated. You can see the arrow went through his chest, look. There it is. You see it. Ebony war axe, don't need most of that stuff. Are you okay? Beamja! He's okay, he's okay, man. Don't worry. Uh, restore health, uncommon taste. You know what, I actually know who wrote this book. The Gourmet wrote this book, who's a chef in Skyrim. Man, I play this game too much. Um, steel battle axe. There's actually a unique weapon in here that we're going to be finding. And it's a pretty special weapon. Oh, the, oh my god, this is so obvious. It's going to be a trap here. You can already hear them attacking other people. Ugh. I don't know what that trap was, but I heard it. I think there were some like steel spears that would. I'm getting paralysis effects all over the place. So these guys are the invincible then, because they literally just get downed like a follower does. I'm just getting back. It's going pretty well. Don't worry, they're, they're paralyzed. You can hit them, you know. You don't need to block. This red guard isn't very smart. See, the Aragonian knows what's up. He's just going crazy at them. Ha! <laughs> Look at his arm. Interesting. Is that soul gem? Fortify archery. I might use that actually. There's a little hidden chest here. Oh, lovely. It's got a lockpick. Do you know what? I've actually got used to it, and Elder Scrolls Online um, has a better lockpicking system, I think. Maybe if you obviously you need the timer there because it's an MMO and it makes it fair. But oh, they were waiting for me. That's nice. Nothing else in there. But it, it's much better. It's like the Oblivion one, which I prefer. Oh my god. What? What is going on? Where did he go? He just literally spazzed Val. Did you see that? Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Nope. Don't stop it with your frozenness. Followers, my companions, they're not helping me. Sit back down. That's right, bow to me. And that was a good kill cam. Haven't had a good kill cam in a while. Ah, oh, coming back to Skyrim, I'm, I realize how much I miss it. I mean, the Elder Scrolls Online is good for an MMO. But it's not Skyrim by any means. Like, you don't get the same immersion. Oh, look, there's a helmet on a plinth. It's definitely a pressure plate. I'm guessing I have to open it to um, open the door, though. Dwarven helmet of destruction. You know what? It looks good. Oh, did not want to be standing there. So that pressure plate activates the door. Then, um, what do we have down here? Okay, is this a boss fight? What are you on about? Let's just get the treasure here and go. So it looks like the Aragonian wants to take on this boss. Do I get to open the door? Oh, this is so exciting. Look. I'm Are you ready? We're gonna run in now. No, you want me to go in first. Oh my god, there's a dragon priest. Someone there. Time to end this. 
trying to get a sneak attack on. What? Stop hurting my friends. Okay, what have we got here? The skeleton. Oh my god, my aiming has gone askew. Why is the skeleton attacking the, um... What's going on here? The skeleton's just killing the boss for me. Do I actually follow this guy or something? It's fine, I've got this, like, skeleton that's just confused now. He's helping me out. Oh, he's looking at me. He's looking at me. Soul gem. Um, Remanate Corpse. That's a really good spell, actually. Sports in this boss chest. There's stamina, potions, minor smithing, elven armor, stuff in the mage light. Never have enough light. What? You guys didn't even help! I should thank you. I knew the girl wouldn't be strong enough to help me kill Gathric alone. Just, There's okay. just one more thing I need from you. To fully absorb Gathric's power, I require a blood... Sorry, what? Plot twist? Your blood should be good enough. This will go easier for us both if you don't bother fighting back. Oh my god, Beamja. I liked you. You were the cool one. Well, the, guard, the red guard's on my side. Oh, even she's in in the way. Did I hit him? No, did I hit her? Oops. Where are you? Bastard. Stop running around, you crazy motherfucker. Got you, got you. One shot, you got owned. One more shot, you're dead. I can actually get you. Oh yes. Beam jar. Why are you saying that? He wasn't your friend. Tried to kill us. He was a bloody traitor. A letter to Beamja. Keep my daughter safe, and you'll earn both your freedom and that damned book you want so badly. But by the divines, anything comes to her. I'll make sure everyone I do business with will hear about what you did in Black Marsh. Okay. Uh, probably an empty threat from that girl's dad. But he has some good loot on him, so I'm happy. How about you? Father never trusted Beam. Alright, what's her dad? I always thought he was just being overprotective. Well, listen to your dad. Look, I never needed treasure. My father owns land. Our family is wealthy. I just wanted adventure. Not well, that's this. That's not what we said earlier. Go on without me. I think I need to be alone for a while. I'm oh, sorry, you can't go across the room with me. I don't know. Beamja has looked after me since I was knee high to him. I need to rest, and then I think I'm going back to Hyrule. No wonder he's so ugly and wrinkly. Go on without me. I think I need to be alone for a while. Should we kill her? Oh, back to High Rock. Maybe we can find her at High Rock and see if um. Actually, High Rock. That's that's not in Skyrim. Anyway, word wall. This is a really good chat, by the way. Become ethereal. And here we have the unique weapon on the back of the throne. Still battle axe of fiery souls. I'm going to put a link in the description to why that's so good. Uh, there'll be a leveled shield here as well that you can pick up. I don't really need it. It looks cooler on the back of the throne, actually. You, this throne should definitely be facing the other way. I mean, come on, man. Like... Oh, I'm going to sit on my throne and face this wall, yes. No, stop it. Stop it. So how do I get out? Do I have to... There must be a shortcut out. Let's look at the map. Oh, right, sir. It's down here. 
Is that girl still here? I'm going to kill her. I don't care what you guys think. I don't want to see what she has on her. Ah! Orcish Sword of Arthing. Take 10 points of shock damage. Okay, letter. Oh, we get to read a letter. It was totally worth killing you. Daughter. So this is her dad. I may seem like a dating old fool, but I still don't like this. The word is a more dangerous place than you realize, and hunting for treasure is a fool's life. Tread carefully and keep half an eye on Beamjar. He should be able to protect you, but do not trust him. Come back as soon as you're tired of this charade. So if I take that letter, I wonder if I can give it to her dad. Get some kind of reward. Like, ah, oh, bro, I killed your daughter. I return this letter to you. Rewards much. Um, how much? Okay. Activate chain. Great. So I'm, this is the way out, and I'm guessing it leads to outside. I'm not so sure. That's a strange sound coming out there. It's a long spiral staircase. Activate door bar. Oh, that view. That is a beautiful view. Wish it wasn't so dark. I might wait until day just so you guys can see it. Is there anyone else up here? Or is it just me? Hello? Is there a dragon up here? Oh my god! Is that Mars? Or is it. No, it's, we have two moons in. Um, in Cyrodiil? Or Tamriel? Is it the world? Two moons. Look at that. That looks amazing. Motherfucking astronomy there. Alright, what's this up here? Oh, uh, this is actually an unmarked location. And there are a few chests here. There's nothing special. I think it's just uh, when you climb to the top of the mountain, you have... Oh my god, there's some ice ropes. I have quite a few unmarked location videos. They actually show you um, locations that are actually useful. So I'll put links to those in the description as well. And I'll be doing a few more because there's quite a lot of locations. Why am I wearing a chef hat? What? The hell? Yeah. Fucking dungeoneering like a chef, bro. Warhammer of flames. Fantastic. That's what you want? I'm not actually going to use that, but um, there's some um, Quicksilver ore up here too. But that's the end of the Let's Play, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe for more tips and helpful videos. See you in the next one.